Hello Explorers, welcome back. So we're going to do a travel cash shopping and I honestly sat here for like 10 minutes just trying to decide what cash stuffing I wanted to do today because I have two binders that I'm working on creating um, and really the holdup is just, well one of them, uh, part of the holdup is that my I'm waiting on something from Amazon but it's out for delivery right now but also I can't print the challenge I made to go with it. <coughs> excuse me um and that's for the japan binder i am still waiting on the japan binder I, I don't mean still as in like it's taking forever i literally just ordered it um but i am waiting on my japan binder from janelle ray budget still i'm just going to be using a regular binder of mine in the meantime um but i made a challenge to go with the japan binder and i can't print it so i'm gonna see if my husband can print it from his laptop or his computer and see if it'll work um and if not I don't know what I'm gonna do so yeah I don't know so we have 150 170 190 210 220 230 240 250 260 270 280 81 82 83 84 85 86 87 88 89 90 91 92 93 94 95 96 97 98 99 300 I did come with less this week because the last couple of times that I have, or well, the last time that I came with 400, it was just entirely too much um, for the challenges that are in this binder. So we're going to try it with $100 less today and see how that goes. Let's go ahead and do a sky's the limit. Uh, let's do this one down here. So we have Oklahoma. Let's see. How many states have I scratched that I've actually been to? Because I've never been to Oklahoma. Let's see. Michigan. Um, I actually grew up. We had a, a summer house in Michigan growing up. Like, my family owned, like, three of them. Not my mom specifically, but, like, my family owned three of them, like, going down a hill. Like, one, two, three. Um, so I spent a lot of time in Michigan. My husband also worked in Michigan when we lived in Indiana. Uh, Tennessee, I've mentioned before, my dad's, my sister's dad is from Tennessee, so definitely been to Tennessee. But let's look up flights to Oklahoma. Flights to Oklahoma. Flights to, okay, from Vegas. Let's see. Okay, $49. That is so doable. Here's 50. Let's do another one because we already know we're, we, we don't have any other big challenges in this binder. So let's just go ahead and do another one. We'll do this one up here. And we got New Jersey and that's where it's probably going to cost me a lot. So I'm probably going to regret that decision. Let's see. Flights to New Jersey from Las Vegas. Oh, Expedia says I can get sixty-nine dollars. So sixty-nine plus forty-nine is a hundred and twenty-eight, right? Am I doing my math correct? No, I'm sorry, 118. So let's put back this 50 we'll take a hundred and we'll take, we'll take 120 and see if we got two ones in there. We do. So in flights, we have one, two, three, four, four, 50, five, 20, 40, 60, 86, 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 97, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 755. And you know what I think the difference is? I think one of them I scratched and it was like super duper duper high. It was like $180 or something. And I told you guys, I was like, that's so weird because it's so much higher than the other ones. Well, here's the thing. I think with that one, I actually clicked on Expedia. So it gave me the round trip total. And on these other ones, I've just been doing it based off what comes up when I let me lower the brightness so you can see what comes up when I Google 
from Expedia and it's $69 flight to Newark, which is one way or $141 for round trip. But I've just been doing it based off of this price for all these other ones. And I think that's what got me on one of them. But that's okay. We just saved extra money. Not a big deal. So let's move this binder out of the way and let's work on the rest of these. So we have this Honey Dukes one. This is from Steps on a Budget. This is going to go obviously towards um, our Universal Studios budget. And we got the Jelly Beans. So that is $2. Let's go ahead and do one more. So I'm not trying to finish this one right away. And I don't know what this one's supposed to look like, but it looks like an empanada. Um, and that's $3. So putting five into this one. So in Honey Dukes, we have 10, 15, 20, 22 dollars. I want to make a dashboard for this, but again, I have a current working printer and it's driving me nuts. Okay, this one is one of my own. This is a picture of the Bellagio here in Las Vegas. This is going to go towards our hotel budget. Um, this is available on my Etsy and we got 21. I did want to mention um, I will be closing my Etsy May, uh, like the first two weeks of May, I think, possibly longer. Um, it might just, I might just be closing it all of May. So if you wanted anything, um, now is the time to get it. <clears throat> so we have 20, 45, 46, 47, 48 in the hotel. Souvenirs. This is another picture of mine available on my Etsy. This was taken at California Adventure, Disney. Disney's California Adventure. Um, and that is $5. Alright, so let's take five. I might have came with too many ones this time. I didn't have enough last time, and I might have came with too many this time. 10, 15, 20, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29. Yes. Okay, this next one is for our Disney budget, and this is from Steps on a Budget as well. This one is absolutely gorgeous, and we got another eight. I'm only doing one on this one because I really don't want to complete it, even though I have others from her. I just really want this one to last. So we have five, six, seven, eight. So in this one we now have, should have 16. 5, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. I'm running low on fives, so I'm going to take these two fives and swap them for a ten. I'm going to keep the ones in there because we've got so many ones. Okay, tickets does not have a challenge in it currently. Food has this challenge from Budget with Carly. So we're going to scratch two on here. And this is a Pizza Planet challenge, which will go obviously towards our food, as I said. It's our, our food budget. So that's $5. And we got an alien. So that is $4. So we're putting $9 into this one. Okay. I'm going to put back a 1 and a 10 and just take a 20. So we have $20 in that one. And that was budget with Carly. Next is gas. 
is another one of mine. This picture was taken in Arizona on our way home from Utah. So we got $6. This is also available on my Etsy. It comes in small and large denominations. Um, it comes in denominations up to 5000 So $6. So five. We're going to swap those for a 10. So 10. There we go. So 10, 11, 12, and 13. Next is Buffer, and this one is from Champagne's Corner. And we got a seven. Okay. So in this one, we're gonna do five, six, and seven. Again, I'm going to swap these fives for a 10. So we have 12 in this one. And that's the end of the binder. So let's do um, and some more on sky's the limit, <clears throat> which is totally fine because there's like a gazillion of these. All right, we got Wisconsin. How much is it to fly from Las Vegas to Wisconsin? Let's see. Flights to Wisconsin. Fifty one. Oh, sorry. I was looking at cheap flights. I need to be going to Expedia. $56. So 55 and 56. I don't think I need to recount this. We already counted it. So let's just add this in there. And I think I'm going to come with even less money next time so that I can put more money into other areas. It's so hard to gauge like how much money you should put into each binder when you do cash stuffings. Normally, obviously my travel ones usually take a lot um, because I usually have really big challenges challenges in there. But this Sky's the Limit has actually been more like um, road trip, like the amounts have been. So, and if you remember correctly, I always had road trip in my travel binder, but I had it alongside the big Disney challenge. Now I don't have it, like this is the big challenge, so. Let's do one more on here. We'll just go through the binder again if we can. So we get that empanada looking thing. Steph, if you watch my channel, which I don't think you do, I mean, I'm not aware. Um, if you do, can you tell me what that's supposed to be? Because it looks like an empanada, but it doesn't make sense to me. So one, two, three. So I don't think we need to recount all of these. Uh, we can. 10, 15, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25. Um, you're fine, baby. Hotel. This one's going to take a good chunk. 29. So we have 20. Let's go back a one and we'll take an, we'll take 30. Okay, so in this one we now have 20, 40, 50, 60, 75, 76, 77. This one does bring in 250, so it's a hefty one. But that is okay. I like to have a couple of big ones in my binder and then a couple of little ones so that when I'm running low on money, I can have some little ones to do. When I have a lot of money, I have some to do. This one is towards souvenirs, and we got a six. Okay, so five and six. Just a 
folded that five. All right, so we have 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35. Those little shavings everywhere. I almost ordered a little vacuum, you guys. I did, but then I didn't order it. <laughs> um, I don't want to do another one on this one because I don't want it. It don't, doesn't have very many spots on it. It's got four, five left, and I just don't want to rush through that one. So let's do. We'll do another one on. Yeah, we'll do another one on gas because mine are not a big deal. Ten dollars. Okay, so five and ten going into gas. So now gas has ten, fifteen, twenty, twenty one, twenty two, and twenty three. Let's see what we have left over because I might just put the rest into um, build a savings. Let's see. We have 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17 dollars. I know that's a lot, but I am. I'm going to go ahead and put the rest into build a savings because we have a couple of big ones on there we need to knock out anyways. And the only thing I have left to do in the travel binder would be some of the small ones and we would just finish them up and I don't really want to do that. <clears throat> so I think 13, no, 14 is the biggest we have on here. So let's do a 14 and we'll do a three. Do we have a three? We do. So we'll do 14, this 14. I kind of want to do one of these, this 11 or 12 though, just because they are lower and we can complete, start working on completing this row, but I'm not going to, I'm going to do the 14 because that's how I've always done this. So we have 14. And we have... that three, which is blue. I haven't quite decided where this money is going. Um, it's going to take a long time to finish because I'm not in a hurry to complete this one. So, that is it for this travel binder cash shopping. And I will see you guys back here for my next video. So until next time, bye.